Do you ever get excited you're going to go shopping and you go to Nordstrom's and you start looking at the rack and you're like, oh, I love this style. I love this color. And the gal says, oh, can I put it in a dressing room for you? And you're like, yeah, this looks great. Then you're kind of shopping a little bit further and you see some really cool pieces on the mannequin and you're like, I love that. That's amazing. I can't wait to try it. You're having a great day. It is the new season and there's new colors and new styles out. And then what happens? You get into the dressing room and things start falling apart. You're trying on the clothes. You love the color. You love the style and it doesn't fit. And you try on a few more pieces and it doesn't fit. And you begin kind of really start beating up on yourself and you're thinking, what's wrong with me? My body is so hard to fit. What's wrong with me? And it's depressing. You're inside that dressing room because you are ready to buy and nothing is fitting like you want it to fit. Can I tell you, that is not your fault. Nothing is wrong with your body type. Do you know, I have so many women who will say to me, Annette, I have a really hard body type to fit. If we haven't met, I'm Annette Bond, personal style expert, and I help successful, savvy women just like you. I show you how to express and elevate your personal style, your confidence, and influence from the inside out. We've been on a series right now talking about fashion feng shui. And this is number four, where we're going to talk about body type. I'm going to go back to what we talked about in the third video on color. I talked about honoring your natural coloring. We're going to do the same thing with your body type. See, what you don't know is that every brand and designer isn't made to fit every body type. And so what's most important for you right now is to honor your natural body type. And when I say that, you have heard, probably seen online, there is the inverted triangle, there is the circle, there is the hourglass, there's the rectangle. And you know, for simplified purposes, that's what we're going to talk about a little bit here and use that as a reference. And it's not a bad thing because guess what? God made your body type to be your body type. You are not to be like your friend Susie's body type. You're not to compare yourself to her body type. You are to honor your body type. And what I want you to start thinking about when you start honoring your body type, so when we talk about, let's just say that uh, inverted triangle, you most likely, if you're an in true inverted triangle, you have broader shoulders. You have broader shoulders and you have narrower hips and legs. I want you to start looking at your body type and I want you to start truly, specifically picking out what you love about your body type. Now, if you have those beautiful broad shoulders, you usually have a beautiful decollete. You can wear those off the shoulder uh, blouses or dresses beautifully. You most likely have a slimmer leg compared to your top and some of those skinny pants look absolutely amazing. So I want you to look at your body type with a positive um, 
a positive mindset. I want you to start looking at what's great about it versus what is not great about it. And let's go back a minute to this whole notion on designers and brands. What most women don't realize is a designer is designing, as I am saying this very generally, for a specific body type. That designer is not designing for all five body types. And so you have to be okay with that. I'm going to use this example right now. I just came to my mind was Nike shoes. Nike designed their shoes with a slimmer um, foot. My foot, I have a wider toe bed and I don't fit into Nike shoes. I don't own a pair of Nike shoes. So whether it is your body, whether it is your feet, whatever that might be, designers are designing with a specific body type in mind. So that is not your fault when you see a beautiful piece on a mannequin and it doesn't fit or you love that style and it doesn't fit your body type. But I can almost guarantee you there is a designer out there or brand that is very similar that would fit your body type beautifully. So, you know, it's time to stop thinking that something is wrong with you and to honor your body type and start experimenting with brands and designers that were made especially for you. And you know, this is exactly what I teach in my Women of Definitive Style or my one-on-one -on -one Reveal Your Radiance. It's about focusing on your body type. It's looking at your measurements, horizontal and vertical. That's something else many women don't know about is vertical measurements. And um, that is something that I teach. And so everything that we've been talking about through this whole fashion feng shui style system, it's about you honoring you. It's not comparing to what your friend Susie wears. It's not comparing to what we see online and the celebrities. You know, I was thinking about this not long ago. Back in my day, I can remember mothers would say, those darn magazines are ruining our children because we think that we need to look like that model. We need to be the same weight as that model. And, you know, there was such a comparison thing that went on. But what our mothers didn't know back then is Yes, those models and online celebrities can be an inspiration of maybe we love their style, but they didn't know that all of us are created so uniquely you. And they didn't know that. They didn't know that your um, body type was different from your sister's or your body type was different from your mother's and they didn't know how to dress all those body types. You know, um, I think as women, we, because we're women, that we should know all this, every, all this and that about style and shopping and color and body type. When the truth is, we weren't taught this. I have went through years and years of studying um, the whole style concept and how to work with you. I have worked with hundreds and thousands of women helping women to dress. And my um, prayer is that you can truly accept who you are and dress for who you are and to stop comparing yourself with somebody else and to truly, as I call my, my signature program, um, Reveal Your Radiance, 
so that you can illuminate that beauty within and truly love yourself from the inside out. I hope you have enjoyed this fashion feng shui series and you know there's more to it and I would love to invite you into one of my programs to learn more about that and get to know you. Until then, I want to invite you to go to AnnetteBond.com where you can see everything that I offer and how we might work together. I'll see you soon.